Uh, well, I think one of the fundamental realities uh, of, of climate change um, is that we're running up to limits of growth. Um, whether that's limits that come from running out of resources um, or limits that come from um, exhausting the, the atmosphere's capacity uh, to, to absorb uh, CO2 and, and greenhouse gases. Um, and, and so part of the reality of climate change means that that pursuit of growth as we've normally defined it um, in, in mainstream economics is going to have to come to an end. Um, and, uh, and it's going to come to an end um, either consciously through our own choice and our own uh, smooth transition or it's going to come uh, by force through force of, of reality, um, through the force of the laws of physics um, winning out over the laws of economics. Um, and, uh, you know, and I think when, when we are honest about the reality of climate change, that's one of the conclusions that we come to. Um, so then, then with that understanding, um, turning away from economic growth, or at least redefining economic growth, um, becomes a given rather than a choice, and it becomes a question of um, what's the healthiest way for us to do that? Um, what's the most beneficial way for us to turn away from uh, our old definition of growth or our old pursuit of growth um, towards a, a sustainable economic model? Um, what's the way to do that that's most in line with our shared values and in a way that's going to um, that's going to preserve our humanity in that period of, of transition.